everybody uh, welcome to destiny 2 um, I'm actually doing a channel update and I thought I'd just play some destiny in the background while I do that uh, we're heading to IO just to go and see sir um, I played destiny for a while actually but on the channel there's a lot of um, what would be the word a lot of controversy at the minute with uh, With Destiny uh, 2 because people are a little bit annoyed at it um, and the way things are going now honestly I'm not really like a big high level player so I don't really um, thanks for the loot I don't really uh, subscribe to, to all that I essentially just play it for fun every now and then and don't take things too seriously I guess but I understand when people spend a lot of time in game that they uh, I like this gun by the way. I think I just got it like at the um, faction rally thing. Um, it's pretty good actually. Uh, yeah, I don't really subscribe to the whole like. I understand when people put a lot of hours into a game and then they feel like decisions are made which are, you know, counterproductive to the game or kind of invalidate those hours they've put in uh, that's probably flipping annoying but at the end of the day it's still a lot of fun to go around and shoot things in the head and it still looks absolutely stunning and it still runs at 60 frames per second at 4k <laughs> with everything turned up so i'm a happy boy when i play destiny you know now we're going to go in here and pick up sir's weapon because i don't have it um and um I want it. Don't tell me I don't have enough shards. Don't even give me that. What is going on? Okay, right. Okay, well, I guess we're going to dismantle some stuff. Because I do want that. Um, I like that submachine gun. Scathe lock. Nameless Midnight is a really good scout rifle. Um, the one we've got, it's not a rifle, but it no, I didn't know that actually. Uh, I hate that. Let's get rid of that. And do we have anything that I hate here? Oh, that shotgun will probably go. Oh, should we on? We're on 22. <laughs> um, I don't like that armor. That gets us on 25. Oh, I've got a ton of helmets as well. Probably should have got rid of them first. There we go. So. I wanted to pick up um, melee attacks grant increased resilience and mobility and they highlight injured enemies melee kills greatly store health I'm still I don't think the jade rabbit's any good by the way I just um, I'm at a point where I just want to collect it does that make sense so that's why I brought it because it's a curse of Osiris weapon as well it's a 288 which is better than what I've got that's a 289 yeah, I'll stick with what I've got actually. I like um, Sunshot a lot. I like my primary weapon as well, so I stick with all I got. I brought Jade Rabbit on PlayStation 4 because I still occasionally play that and I used it and I wasn't very impressed with it to be honest. It just seems like it's pretty bog standard. Oh, look at that, we've got a little adventure there. Might as well do that while we're here. So, uh, yeah, anyway, back to the channel update, because I'm sure that's mostly what people are rather than for the Destiny stuff. So, um, we're now into February, which is um, nice, I guess. Should I turn this down as well, actually? Uh, oh, the game volume is on one. Okay. So, I don't think it's actually too bad. Um, so, yeah, we're into February now, and actually doing pretty well, like, everything's kind of picked up after the January slump, which happens every year, it's not really too much you can do about it. Um, you know, anybody who's been going for, you know, longer than a year or so will know that, and, you know, consistently, um, you know, uploading videos will know that there's always a slump in January, and that's fine. But, um, I've been pretty happy with how things are going. 
I've still got a lot of things I need to do and uh, I've been very busy at work and when I say do I mean like series I want to finish and um, get through but um, I've been very busy at work very very busy because a lot of people have been off sick um, there's been like a real kind of just bout of um, like flu going around and um, you know that means that I have to spend longer at work doing things and um, that means that you know sometimes when I spend longer at work little kind of like shall we say side projects that I want to do are you know I'm not going to get around to doing them um, or sometimes I'm just not in the mood to record at all and I'm just kind of like oh well I'll just play you know a game on my own or play a multiplayer game or something like that um, but uh, there you go that's kind of a life isn't it really at the end of the day yeah. sometimes they're bigger than others I mean at the end of the day I'm glad that um, I've been busy at work or that this has happened during a spell when there hasn't really been any new games come out uh, the exception being Monster Hunter I guess but I haven't really done any more videos on that than the one I, I did I'm kind of like with Monster Hunter at the minute I'm like I really enjoy just dipping in and out but that's probably all I'll ever do like I don't really enjoy spending a long time on that game I don't know why um, it's, it's a weird one I don't know it's I think it's a game which a lot of people kind of spend hours on and, and do and stuff like that whereas I, I sort of like take on one monster and then I'll go and like leave the game you know and, and do one mission every now and then but I do enjoy dipping in and out of it um, and I guess because the story isn't really like there I feel like I can um, dip in and out of it a little bit better a little bit nicer than some other like games you know where you have to remember what the story is going on so I guess um, in terms of like the way things are going on the channel I'm very happy there are a few series which are coming to an end uh, soon Mario being one of them just because I've come to the end of the game um, I'm still going on like FIFA for another season god knows why I keep doing that to myself but I don't know it's, just, it's a game which I enjoy recording and I guess it's something a bit different because, um, you know, a lot of people or a lot of channels which are like, say, American, uh, yeah, don't play FIFA. So I guess, if, if anything, I'm, I'm staying true to my British roots by doing a, a football game. Okay, what the hell do I need to do now? Go down this way. I think I probably should have got a new uh, vehicle, but... Never mind. I'm sure at some point I'll find one. Um, yeah, and uh, Subnautica's, I guess, a new game-ish. Uh, it's been around for a while, but it's just got released, and obviously I've been doing a series on that, and I'm really enjoying that, actually. Um, I love that kind of, like, crafting loop. Uh, that kind of, like, Minecraft-esque crafting loop that you get from it. And, um, uh, yeah, so I'm enjoying that a lot right now. Um, and uh, it, it's just going to be exciting, like, as we get deeper and seeing what we can build, you know, the base we can build, things like that. Uh, I'm really looking forward to it because I think that's one of the good things about it is I kind of know a little bit about where the hell am I supposed to be going. I don't want to do that. Oh, hi. There we go. Uh, I do. I, um, yeah, because I have, have played it when it was in its kind of beta form. I know a little bit about where we're going and, and what we can expect, but there are lots of new things as well, so I guess that's good in a way that I um, am a little bit familiar with the game, but I'm still going to be excited with all the new things that are coming with it uh, as well. Uh, let's see, new creatures, I guess, and I never got too far into the game uh, when I played it in its beta. Um, so there was still a lot of late game stuff I never saw, uh, a lot, um, but I knew the kind of general basics of how to survive and, and the the kind of crafting loop that, that there was and stuff like that, so I was pretty happy with that. 
uh, still doing the final, uh, final the final fantasy football I still doing uh, fantasy football uh, it's uh, a, a stable I'm doing that one as much for me as for anything else because I kind of said right at the beginning that I wanted to um, make a video on each week because uh, in the past I've never managed to make it a whole season actually thinking about it and seeing how far I could get so I was intrigued to know if I did that for a year like would I still enjoy it and, and all this kind of thing and I am still enjoying it and I'm still like it pushes me to do better by recording a video on it and stuff like that and doing it and I like talking about football and stuff like that but I do worry sometimes that the channel is a bit football orientated <laughs> so I do apologize if there are some weeks where that is the case but um as I said, I don't know if that's something I'll do next season with the, the fancy football. Um, so, you know, it, it was kind of like something I wanted to do for the season, and I kind of feel like I've got to see it through to the end of the season. And um, while I still enjoy it, um, I'm not sure I would want to be doing that every season sort of thing. Um, but it's been good fun, and um, I got some ideas as a kind of like end of season special video sort of thing uh, of what to do, and and, and seeing um, you know how I did and stuff like that. So I, I'm enjoying that definitely, and um, been playing a bit of GeoGuessr and doing some Google Earth, Google Maps stuff as well, which um, I've kind of been doing because there has been a bit of a dearth of new games as it were but also nothing that's quite taken my fancy in terms of wanting to do you know a lot of videos on it if that makes sense the only thing I'm really ahead on at the minute is FIFA funnily enough um, but again I'm, I'm very 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 reluctant to put more than one video that week because I don't want to um, get into a stage where I have just football videos constantly on my channel is I don't think that's good for me I don't think you guys would enjoy that some of you probably would but you know that's just the way it goes I guess um, and uh, yeah so we're coming up to time I guess towards the end of February when uh, Horizon and Zelda came out especially Zelda was big on my channel still is big on my channel um, and uh, yeah, so it'd be interesting to see. I, I'm thinking through a lot of stuff, and I'll probably do some polls on my community tab of my channel, which I now know how to do. Um, so, like, keep an eye out on there, because I want to do some polls for, some, for what games you guys want to see, because I definitely want to do some more... Fuck, I died. <laughs> Dude, revive me. Thank you. That's hilarious. Uh, at least we got a legendary Ingram. You'll have to take a look. I hope it's And um yeah, I, I kind of want to do like a long playthrough of something, but I also know that long playthroughs of things don't often go to plan, do they? But I think maybe like doing something where I have like actually like two hour episodes or something like really long um, might be quite interesting to try out and I have a couple of ideas for games that um, I'd like to try that on um, you know going ahead which are quite long games uh, one of them being The Witcher 3 um, to replay through that and the other one being Final Fantasy 15 when it comes to PC so I played a fair bit of that on PlayStation I say fair bit a bit and I enjoyed it um, but coming to PC and being able to play it in like 60 frames per second and doing all that and uh, the nature of that game I think it might actually be pretty good fun to play like in an ASMR style and play like a long kind of playthrough and, and do all that type of stuff and um, I am certainly no um, that's actually better look at that that's better um, I am certainly no like Final Fantasy buff or I don't know a huge amount about Final Fantasy I might as well do this one um, 
but uh, I know what I like and I enjoyed that so that's another one I was thinking of doing and um, I guess maybe there's a few others I can think of but they're the two I thought of off the top of my head and I'm talking about doing like probably one to two episodes a week on that and doing a long episode maybe an hour to two hours uh, potentially and uh, working through um, that game but in terms of like new games coming out there's a few which have caught my eye um, without a doubt um, Kingdom Come Deliverance yeah uh, is like interesting me, to me but I'm very sceptical because at least at the time of me recording this it comes out literally tomorrow so I'm recording this on Monday the 12th and um, I uh, have not seen one review out for that game yet which is very interesting I've watched a video um, on YouTube of somebody playing it through like I guess early access he got it a few days early because he was kind of partnering with the, the guys making the game um, but you can always take those playthroughs with a pinch of salt because like you know there's probably a, an agreement there when you get the game early as to um, what exactly you can say and can't say about the game and stuff like that but it looked interesting I will give it that it, it, it's, it looks nice the game looks nice I wouldn't say it looks incredible um, but it looks very nice and considering like it is an indie game like make no mistake it's very much an indie game God, I wasn't a hunter then. Okay. Um, yeah, so it interests me, so I'm going to definitely wait for reviews and kind of see what comes out of it. And if it's good, then I may well play through the game or play some of the game. Um, as I said, Final Fantasy is interesting to me as well. Oh, there's a chest out. Cha ching So, it turns out both the music and the quotation predate the traveler's arrival in this solar system. They're old. Maybe. But, um, as I said, I'm. I'm intrigued by that. Final Fantasy 15 I've already spoken about as well. I'm very intrigued by that. See how that looks on PC. There's been a little bit of controversy about that because of all the uh, Nvidia stuff going on with it as well. If you haven't been following it, they've got this like Nvidia hair works and like game works and Okay, I'm not gonna capture it, but um Yeah, as I said, there's been some controversy over that and like the benchmark thing they brought out and what that actually entails and you know, so again, keeping an eye on it, like sometimes these Japanese games, PC ports are absolutely shocking, but you have to say it's taken them long enough to bring it to PC and honestly, if they still can't get that right, then I don't really know what to say at this point. <laughs> um, so I'd keep an eye on it anyway. Uh, Far Cry 5 as well. I'm very interested in. I like the look of this game. I've seen some like gameplay videos and things like that, and kind of what you can do. And it looks very, very much like every other Far Cry game. But that's not necessarily a bad thing. Um, whether or not, I mean, I'm not planning on doing like a playthrough of that, but certainly. I feel like I'd do a few videos on it here and there and just have some fun in the game and see what I'd do um, in that terms. But yeah, I'm pretty excited for that, to be fair. Um, and yeah, I mean, I don't really think there's a huge amount of other things coming out that I am like desperately like awaiting, you know? Um, I feel like after the launch of the Switch last year and what that brought and then some like really strong PlayStation titles coming early in Horizon um, then we had things like Mass Effect Andromeda, Ghost Recon Wildlands 
uh, those sort of games. Was it Mass Effect last year? I think it was. Yeah, it was. Yeah. Um, you know, there was a real buzz around sort of like March, which I don't feel like we've got this year. But that's not to say it's a bad thing. And I've got loads of games I still want to play. Um, oh, another game I was thinking about for like a long playthrough session was Metal Gear Solid Five, as well, um, because it's like my part of shame for a game I never finished and kind of feel like I'd like to play it but I might like as I said do a poll and see what people think uh, if people are interested so just keep an eye out on the channel sorry when it said follow the music I have no idea where I'm going oh I can hear it it's in here it's in here Okay. Um, but yeah, so as I said, it's like I'm intrigued by a lot of games coming out, but I'm not like, oh, 100% gonna do this game, 100% gonna do that game. Um, but we'll see. Have you got the same gun as me, mate? I think you have, haven't you? It's a good gun. Follow the music, Aaron Seaball. Um, so, yeah, I guess just kind of steadily ticking along. I said before that um, I want to try and do some more streams. Um, I'm going away for like five days, um, five or six days probably, at the end of this week that I'm currently in, um, kind of like from the 15th, 16th, I think, of February. Um, when I get back, I'm not planning on going anywhere for a while, so um, probably not until April. So I'm definitely going to try and do some streams in March and actually get that going. My internet worries me because um, it does kind of click in and out. Weirdly, when I seem to play games like Destiny, there's no problems, but whenever I use the internet, like just browsing and stuff like that, it tends to just drop every now and then. So I don't quite know why that is. Um, but we'll see obviously for streaming you want to not have it drop that's a really bad thing but um oh we've got to find this music again um it's a bit of a pain doing a sound one when i'm trying to record this video because i have to kind of listen out and also do this i can hear something gets louder shall we but yeah but also like feel free if there's a game which you're like super stoked about or excited about and you're like oh i'd love to see you play through that like do please like leave a comment uh whether on this video or one of the others because i'm always intrigued to know um you know what you kind of like stuff like that i've tried on the whole to just play games that i like so just because someone necessarily um Uh, recommends a game doesn't mean that I will play through the game I think that's probably a fair assumption though right um, like for example I know the the hot game at the minute is something like Fortnite Battle Royale or like um, uh, you know PUBG but I just generally don't enjoy those games so I'm sorry if you are someone who does and you want to see things like that where's I can hear this quite loudly now it could be below me right now you go away that's rude found it Yeah, so 
I try to stay away from like those games because I just don't enjoy playing them. Like I have played them. Uh, well, Fortnite, I've played PUBG, um, but uh, yeah, it's just, it's just not my kind of game. Like, I'm not saying it's bad. It's kind of like Overwatch. You know, the big hot thing was Overwatch, and like again, I just don't like Overwatch. Uh, it's unfortunate. Maybe my channel would would grow better if I liked games like that. But you can only like what you like, and always said that this is essentially a hobby and what is the hell would be the point of me playing games I don't like just to get views <laughs> like it would be idiotic couldn't it oh god where is what's in here hello hello is anybody here I've come to say hello and kick some butt Oh, look, he's in there. Hey, buddy. You know, I'm gonna be really disappointed if this is all just an elaborate trap. It probably is an elaborate trap to kill us, isn't it? Let's face it. Generally, it seems to be what happens. Oh, yeah. I like this all the rifle. It's pretty darn good. these things. Do you know what? I still haven't done any of the bloody raids in uh, Destiny. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh fuck. Where the hell did you guys come from? Should probably be using this on, on those guys. That's right. Suck it. Nice. I love this weapon though so much. Even though it's severely underpowered compared to a lot of my other weapons, it's still so good. It's so good. And the light show is pretty spectacular as well. is that I haven't upgraded my computer since my last update. <laughs> I've managed to uh, resist. I um, I haven't. I should probably do a video on like talking about computers and computer parts and things like that and recommendations. These are it's pretty would be interesting. I'm not an expert by any means, but I've certainly done a lot of research over the years about what's good and stuff like that, and certainly about like, you know, you know, cost, performance, percentages and things like that, you know, oh shit, time to heal up, friends, there we go, oh shit, what the fuck is that? I feel like that was a bad place to put that. That was a bad place for me to put myself. Okay, right. Excuse me, sir. I do not want anything that you're selling. Thank you so much. Yeah, maybe I will do a like an interesting um, kind of like cost per performance or upgrade guide or something like that about like the PCs are interesting, right? Because you get what's called detrimental gains where like you spend so much money and you don't really see any sort of like benefit to your PC in terms of gaming performance or anything like that um, so yeah maybe it would be interesting to do something like that I'll just talk about how you can like me waste all your money on computers oh fuck so you just have to follow the music and sit down this way 
ったねはっ Oh, what's this?
a sharp different no one cares uh, I know about this Mida mini tool thing it's pretty good it's a uh, submachine gun it fires very very fast uh, and actually looks pretty nice I think C certainly compared to the um, yeah you see it fires exceptionally quick oh my god look at that reload speed that is fucking insane Okay, I like this gun. <laughs> that is ridiculous. That is like game breakingly ridiculous. Okay. Let's do one more mission on here. Oh, yeah, did I. S I don't know if I said, but. Um, I. Oh, he's just got packages and stuff like that. I. Um, um, I just. <laughs> Didn't manage to finish the Destiny playthrough because of size because the game crashed. This feels very fast. It feels very smooth as well. My god, I love playing at 60 frames per second. <sighs> I know like PC like owners bang on about it, but guys, seriously, it's good. It's so good. <laughs> It's like a really fast um, sparrow for some reason, I don't know why. I said it might just be because it, um, it's so smooth, but I don't like it. I'm always suckers. Yeah. I don't like the way my coat is like clipping through the through there. Um, yeah, I was saying about Skyrim, yeah, I keep getting crashes, but uh, I want to persevere and go through that game and actually um, finish the, the Thieves Guild questline, because I quite enjoy it. Um, but uh, it does keep crashing, and that's kind of a pain. But it looks so good as well. <laughs> so, yeah. And then um, after I do that, I'm going to get back to the main series. I'll get past that hundred episodes. Nah, I don't want that. I'll take that. And let's just... Take you out, you son of a gun. I love killing people in the air. That's a data fragment. That was a headshot, come on. What are we doing here? Okay. Not being impressed with this Jade Rabbit at all. It looks good, I like the way it looks. Like it looks pretty cool, I'm sure it'll look good when you use a new skin, a oh, new um, shader. Does it light the targets up as well? I guess. But um, other than that, I'm not too impressed with it. I'm impressed with this though. That is for shizzle. Um, okay, that's just telling me that the thing is there. Ah, okay, here we go. Shoot the gun. I guess the reload time is not terrible for for it. The handling's okay as well. It's, it just seems to me to be like a decent all round, kind of like just very average, but not bad, but also like not spectacular. Not sure it's something I would want to have on my exotic slot constantly, but there you go. It's not just. It's not just. Um, in terms of destiny, 
as well. Like, uh, as I kind of said at the beginning, there's been a lot of backlash about this game, which is kind of like, um, it's a little bit sad that there is that. Um, but they kind of brought it on themselves and the stuff they've done. And the Curse of Osiris DLC was disappointing. Like, I am a person who just enjoys playing Destiny, but even I know that that was not good value. Like, Mercury looked great, but it was so small. There was just really nothing to explore. Um, they had, like, one public event, I think. The, the missions were, like, so generic, it was unreal. Um, and this kind of, you know, legendary guardian Osiris was just a real kind of disappointment. miles away from it, for God's sake. Goodness me. And thank you if you have kind of stayed with the video this far, because I realise I've just been kind of rambling for about the last 15 minutes, but I'm kind of enjoying playing Destiny and that's going to count for something. As it is. 
fuck off. Are you joking me? Ay, 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 ay. I wasn't even near that thing, I swear to God, I was not even near it. Anyway. Asking yourself, Phil, why are you using the dawn blade? It's not, it's not the best like one to use. And I say to you, that's exactly my life and destiny. <laughs> like not using the best thing I should be using is exactly what I do best in destiny. In other words, I don't tend to min-max anything. I tend to just use what I like. Fucking hell, there appears to be a lot of guys around here. Nothing special. Okay. It's just those three left. We know that a veritable army of arseholes <laughs> start coming for us up here. Let's try and blow one of these up. Okay, let's go. 
Let's go. I was hoping that was going to explode with some sort of like huge explosion wiping out all the enemies in the area, but alas, that did not happen. Oh fuck, here we go. Here's the big guy. I feel like the um, sun shot would actually be better. Fuck, what was that? Oh, here comes the big guy. I like just in time. literally just it. Okay, well, I think that um, that will be the last mission I do, but I, I guess I should probably head back to Earth and do those. Um... Wait, was that it? I think it was it. Um, I should probably head back to Earth or the tower and um, cause we're on Earth, I guess. Um, This ship too that I've got. I think it's like uh, like one of the like yellow um, Engram ships. Separate walls, no, no. 
that space off of Oh, nice. Got auto rifle. Which I might as well get rid of all of these then. Because I'm not gonna replace MIDI tool with anything anytime soon. Thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you guys next time. Bye-bye.